Technology of Penner Tubes with Gasoline-Fired Heating Pistons in Vietnam When patching motorcycle tires, people often use heat to press on the patch to make it stick better. In the past, according to many years of experience, in addition to using patches combined with glue, patchers also heat pressed with electricity or oil. When observed, it seems more secure and secure, but few people know that due to the difference in heat reaction at the pressing point and at the pressing point, after a short time, the tire cover can swell and account for a certain percentage, not the majority. People often call it a heat-pressed patch, commonly found on motorbikes or large trucks. The principle of this type of patch is to use heat to melt the young rubber that has fixed the glue and adhere tightly to the puncture hole in the surface of the tire, helping the patch to be firm and airtight. And the important thing here is the experience of the worker to keep the temperature of the patch and the tire at the right temperature so as not to affect the tire. But it is impossible for a mechanic to keep track of the right temperature for each type of tire, not to mention the condition of the tire and the number of dozens of tires each day, which will deform the tire surface, causing the tire to swell. Currently, this type of heat-pressed patch is only a few and is often only applied to two-wheel vehicles. Nowadays, technology has developed a lot, Tire repair shops have gradually switched to glue patching, also known as live patching. This method is similar to heat patching, but people use specialized rubber pieces with a separate type of glue for extremely good adhesion even when operating continuously on the highway without the need for heat pressing to reinforce and minimize tire swelling.